السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Welcome dear students to our science class Today is Thursday and it's the weekend Yay! Yay. The date is the 4th of November uh, Sorry, 4th of February 2021 Our new lesson in our new chapter We'll start chapter 7, unit 7 And the lesson is what are physical properties of matters? What's a property? When we are talking about property of matter, what do I mean? I am describing the matter, but what I am describing uh, uh, in this matter? Who can tell me? Am I describing the weight? or describing the shape or describing the feeling or what? Yes, Yaritaal. Let's see, Ritaal. No, I didn't understand the question. Okay, property of matter, when I want to describe some matter, first of all, you know what's matter? Everything around us is a matter, is that right? Anything that have a mass and takes up space, it is matter. Now, if I want to describe this matter, I'm going to talk about the properties, things that this matter have or features that this matter have. Like, uh, I want you to tell me, like what? It can have what? Sorry, teacher, I can't really open my camera. It's okay, Maria. Next time I want to see your beautiful smile and your beautiful face. All right. Sorry, okay. teacher. It's all right. Yes, Yaritaal? Please? What? Trees. Trees. Trees are matter. How can you describe the tree? Tell me, if you want to tell someone about the tree, can you describe the tree? Yes. Leanne, you It's are next. Has, Just let me let the uh, retail finish. It has a thick. Um, wow. Thick, yes. Stem, log. or log, or branch. Uh, it has a. Yes. Okay. And it has a lot of leaves. Nice. What is the shape of these leaves? Square? Oh, like pink. Round? Yeah. Okay. Thank no. you, Rital. Okay. Thank you, Rital, for trying. Yes, Yelian. What do you think, Yelian? About a tree? Not about the tree. What are the properties of matter? What do you describe about matter? Can I say an example? Yes, of course. Uh, like a, let's say an ocean or an ocean. Okay. An ocean, ha it has living creatures like, um, and also people can swim in there and it's, it's color is blue. Nice. And you describe the color. Is it big or small? It's actually really big that you can't see the ending of it. Nice, very nice, Leanne. Now I want to give you another example. Can you describe this ice cream? What does it look like from the inside and outside? Yeah. Okay, try, tell me. Yes, I know. Tell me. I know, miss. Just a minute, I'm asking Leanne. Oh, me, mm, this ice cream from Inside, I think, because uh, this ice cream, ice cream has shapes, like different shapes and Excellent. also different flavors. Shapes, flavor, yes. And also it has different, different tastes, like this Taste, ice cream. excellent, see? Shape, taste, flavor, huh? Is it and the same texture? No. No, because texture. What about color? No, because this ice cream is chocolate and vanilla. Sometimes there's ice cream that like are strawberry and vanilla or chocolate and 
of Excellent. strawberry. Excellent. Thank you very much. That's enough, Leanne. So when I'm asking about the property of matter, I'm telling about the features that this matter have. I'm describing the shape. I'm describing the color. I am describing the uh, taste, the smell, and everything that is related to this matter. So any feature or any something special about this matter can be the property of this matter. So we, today we're going to learn about physical properties, not any property, but physical property. Now, I just told you briefly about what is property. Let's learn what does it mean physical. What do you think physical mean? Yeah, Diala, do you have any idea about physical? Uh, no. Okay, physical is something can move maybe, or something you can feel with your own hand, or you can use it with your uh, five senses. When you use your five senses to notice something, this is physical, okay? Okay, now. Yes, thank you, Diala. Thank you. Rayana, I thought you, I heard your uh, voice. You wanted something, Rayana? What? I, I think I heard your voice. D did you want it something? I want to answer, but I just chose Leon. It's okay. Thank you, Rayana. I will choose you again. Yes, Yalulua. What page? Uh, do not open the book. I want you to look with me. Take a look at the screen. Okay? Do okay. not open your book. Doesn't need to open your book. Later, when I want you to open, I will ask you to open the page. All right, Lulu? Thank you very much. Okay, so now we know that matter is anything that takes up space and have a mass. Anything, anything. So this sandwich, look at this big sandwich. Is it a matter or not? Hi, Rayana. Is it matter or not? Very matter because yes. it has many things and very big and take different. No, it does, it's not because it has many things. Because it has a mass and yeah. does it take up space? Yeah. And yeah, also, so it is a matter. Mm -hmm. What about the air in the balloon? Air inside a balloon. Is it a, ma a, a matter or not air? Is it a matter? Uh, I think yes. Because... Yes, it is matter. Thank you, Yariana. Now let's see who knows why air is a matter. Why oh. air is a matter? Yes, Yari Tal. Rital, unmute yourself. Because it's everywhere. And does it take up space? Yes. Yes, does it have a mass? What? Of course it has a mass. Of course if it has a mass. If you fill the balloon with air and you have another balloon without air, which one is heavier? The one that filled up with air or the one without air? What do you think, Italia? Yes, teacher. What do you think? Which uh, one will be heavier? The one that filled up one with air. air? Huh? The one with air. Excellent. The one with air. Very good. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Now we know what is matter. And... Yeah. If I told you that when you use your all five senses to notice a property, this is a physical property. This is what do we call a physical property. So can we underline the main ideas about matter and physical property? Now you can open to page 352, 352, and underline with me. So what is a physical? Yes, you can go to the bathroom. What is a physical property? Please, guys, if you want to go to the bathroom, you can close your camera, go quickly and come back. Do not tell the teacher, okay? You are big enough to do that. MashaAllah, tabarakallah. And I trust you, you will go and come back quickly. 
page 300 and what? 52. See, it's here, over here. Can you see it? Uh, Can you see it? Oh. Yes. Okay. So, a physical property is a characteristic of matter that you can observe or measure directly. Okay? You can measure and observe directly. How? By using your five senses. Using your five senses. Observe anything you can observe is anything that you can uh, use your five senses to do it. And matter is anything that takes up space and has a mass. All right. That leads us to oh, yes. learn what is mass. What is mass? Mass is the amount of something. Okay. In an object, we call it amount of matter. In an object, what do we call it? Matter. The amount of matter. In an object, we call it mass. The amount of matter. In an object, what do we call it? Mass. mass. And how can we yeah. measure mass? We can measure mass using what? Yes, Yelian. I think tools. Okay, can you name these tools? A pan balance. Excellent. Um, I can use a pan balance. Okay, and who knows what is the unit that I can use to measure mass? Hi, Adiala. Can you try? What is the unit? Hmm. The unit is a, it is um, matter. Okay, if I am, uh, I'm asking you, how much does this sandwich weight? Wait, I need to, yes. Is it liters, grams, kilograms, or centimeters? What do you think? Centimeters. Really? The weight. If you are using a pan balance, look at this one. I need to know how much does it weight, this apple. A matter? I don't know. A mass? Yes, the mass of this apple, how much? Is it centimeter, liter, or kilogram? Kilogram. Excellent. It is kilogram or grams. So I can use kilogram or grams, all right? Okay, in a minute, guys. All right, girls, can you close your mics, please? So we said we use grams and kilograms to measure the mass. Very good, very good. All right. Now let's do this exercise very quickly. If I want to use my five senses to observe this sandwich, what can you see? You can see shapes in the sandwich. What other property you can see with your eye? What can you see? Hmm. Using your eyes. Yes, Elian. Elian, what can you see, Elian? I can see. Um, I can see a sandwich. Okay. I need you to tell me the property you can see. We agreed that property can be uh, shape, color, uh, uh, texture, whatever, huh? Something you use I your think, eyes. Yes. I think the. I think you can see the lettuce because it's colored and it has a shape. Excellent, the color and shape. So I can see the color. And shape. and shape. Very good. That's just an example. You can see many things. All right. And you can hear the bite into a sandwich. You might hear the crunch of the crust. 
Is that right? It sometimes it feels yummy when you hear that sound. You feel, oh, <laughs> I am hungry. The crunches of the chips. Oh, <laughs> I think the crunches of the chips that the most delicious sound I can hear. Do you agree or not? Yes, I uh, yes. agree. <laughs> what about the smell? Oh, imagine if you can smell from the kitchen, uh, maybe my, your mom baking a cake. It's a chocolate cake. What a good smell you can smell that time. Yes, yes. Lulua. No. Lulua? Miss? Yes, Lulua. What's your favorite food? My favorite food, pizza pepperoni. <laughs> Are you still asking? <laughs> miss, miss, miss. Yes. I saw like in cartoons, cartoons, but they smell a uh, good smell. They like, fl they close their eyes and they smell with their like, fly to the kitchen to eat it. <laughs> yeah. miss, okay, just a minute, please. By turns, raise your hand. Yes, Ileyan. If that actually happens, if you actually cook like or do a cake on the first one, you eat it. Yes, that's right. That's <laughs> right. Diallo, is that is that you, Diallo? You said I want to tell you something, or who who's that? That Diallo, we miss. Yes, Diallo. I said not, not me. I oh, not you. you. Okay, let's complete then. Let's complete. You can smell and you can feel the bread. It feels soft. The dressing may feel so oily. The salt and pepper feel grainy. Yeah. What about the taste? What can you taste in a sandwich? What would you taste in a sandwich? I Who know. can tell me? Yes, Yariana. Yes, Yariana. Uh, maybe I can taste cheese, lettuce, cucumber. Is it sweet, um, sour, salty, better? Salty. Huh. Salty. Salty. Excellent. Salty. Sometimes if you put a dressing, it can feel <laughs> sweet. If there is a, a bit dressing. Excellent, excellent. Uh, so these are it. properties of a matter. If you finish writing, we we shall go to the next page. Okay, girls? Okay, you're making before that, can I tell you something? Teacher, you're yes. making me hungry. Yeah, oh, even me. Yes. When you I, I you want you to do, guys, guys, when you eat yeah. your, your dinner or your lunch, sorry, when you eat lunch with your parents, I want you to observe the lunch and feel the properties of this matter. Oh, I want you to I tell me what thing. can you observe, see, hear, smell, or feel the properties. The properties can be the salt. Is it salty, sour, sweet? or better or is it crunchy crunchy crust or soft crust is it um, smells crispy. very yes crispy or whatever and um how does it feel does it feel soft oily or grainy i want you to describe the matter you okay. Okay, okay. I want to tell you something. Uh, just a minute, Yara, Yana, and Leanne. Please, just a minute. Uh -oh, Sorry, okay. Leanne. Just a minute. All right. All right. Look mm -hmm. at this page. Look at this page. I want you to describe it. You can describe if it's hard or soft. You can describe the size. You can describe the texture. See, you can describe the color, the taste, the odor. What is the odor? Odor means what? The smell. You can describe the shape. All these are properties of matter. Now, I want you to take a look at the banana. List five properties to describe the banana. Let's start. Yes, I'm not going to look at that. Why? Banana looks she very like banana. nice. I love bananas. She don't love banana. Who she doesn't love? Really? 
Oh, yeah. so close your ears too. <laughs> because once we describe it, this banana. Okay, once we describe the banana, you will be able to even taste it. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Let's, let's see Lulua. Yeah, oh, let's see Lulua. Lulua, please, can you uh, list five properties about the banana? Come on, Lulua. Tell me the hardness. Is it soft or hard? Soft. Soft. This is number one. What about the size? Is it big or small? Uh, there's big, big bananas and there's small bananas. Okay, this one is a small banana. What about the texture? Is it smooth or rough? It's smooth. Smooth. What about the color? It's yellow. About yellow from the outside and white from the inside. How does it taste? Sweet or sour? What? Hmm. Sweet. Sweet. What about the smell? Does it smell good or bad? It smells good. Good. What about the shape? Oh, good. What? What about the shape? Taste the shape, the shape. Okay. Oh. It looks like a moon. It looks like a half moon. Excellent. Listen, or not a half moon. First, first quarter moon. Let's say first quarter moon. No, it's yes, like a crescent. Excellent, excellent. Very good. Okay, guys, I'm really sorry we have only four minutes left. So, please, only four minutes left. What I want in four minutes is to do this one, please. I want you to tell me what is the color that describes the way light bounces off an object. What color do you see below over here? What color do you see? Hmm. Hello, Miss. Yes, Yatalia. What color do you see? Green and red. Green and red. Excellent. You can write green and red. Now, yeah, lean. Now, these crackers, crackers are salty. Candy can taste sweet or sour. Can you think of something that tastes better? Hmm. What is bitter? Bitter I know, I know, I know. is the opposite of sweet. Hmm. They're like like weird cupcakes no cupcakes never taste better cupcakes taste sweet yeah oh i just wanted something yes, sweeter know. than candy no 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 i want better how things can oh, taste yeah. better yes yeah Leon. Uh, how does it taste better mm -hmm. No, bitter, bitter. Bitter means like coffee oh without God. sugar. Have you ever tasted oh. a coffee without sugar or a medicine? I drink coffee. Yes. yes okay, yes. or and medicine. Macaroni, macaroni doesn't have any sugar. No, 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 no. Not, not, not without sugar. Bitter, bitter, bitter should ta taste the opposite of sweet. It is bitter. It is not I sweet. Cookies are bitter. Really? Cookies are better. Um, Miss Sour. None of them. Mm, really? I've never tasted a cookie that is better. We'll see. I, I want to look about it. Okay, Can about. Give me some idea. Uh huh. So we like cookie. Yeah, I, I just came up with a game. We can play it maybe in, in um next week if we have time in class. We I tell you or we choose a person to tell you. For example, this food is sweet and bitter and we guess what the food is nice description of properties i love it yes yeah. next week we can do it no you write coffee yeah. Ariana. we you write coffee what about coffee? the order yes coffee coffee is How better c-o-f-f-e-e -E. now order <laughs> these shoes are stinky perfume has a nice smell how can order tell you if milk has gone bad if how can you know that this milk is bad if this no. if the uh, if the smell is yes Yaline. if the smell is weird yes or stinky horrible. or you can say stinky horrible. or horrible what yeah. about the shape objects Terrible. can be long short flat tall irregular 
irregular like these keys now shape describes the object form now oh, how can you describe the cell phone over here who can describe the shape of the cell phone yes yeah uh, um, okay. it is like what square, but it is like a square time is it is what rectangle. it is Rectangle, yeah, rectangle. Rectangle, yes. The shape of this cell phone is Teacher, rectangle. Yes, I know. It's not done yet. We, it's still 119. We finished 920. 120. Thank you for telling me. All right, girls, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed. Is there any question about this lesson? No, no, no. 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 It's it's like no. like the uh, beat is better. Nice. Okay, girls, let's say bye-bye to recording. Wait. Bye-bye okay. to recording. Bye, bye recording.